In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to use the C++ API to build a Win32 console application. First, let's open Visual Studio. Create an empty Win32 console application project through Visual C++ Win32. Let's name it Barcode Reader C++ API. Following this guide, first reference the .h and .lib files. To make it easier, let's copy the include folder and lib folder from the installation directory to the project. You can find these two folders under C, Program Files x86, DynamSoft, Barcode Reader 2.0 Trial. Copy the two folders and paste the two folders into this directory. We also need to change the relative path here to the path that's in your project. Next, copy and paste the code of the main function into your program and change the image path. I'm going to use a sample image from the installation folder. For this example, I'll try all supported barcode types.tiff. Now, build the project. Once the build has succeeded, go to the installation directory under C, Program Files, x86, DynamSoft, Barcode Reader 2.0 Trial, Redist, C and C++. Copy the two DLL files here and paste the two files into the debug folder where the .exe file is. Press Ctrl F5 to run the project. We now have a list of all the barcode types that were in the document. Now I'll take a moment to go over some of the code with you. First, we define variables including the image path. And then we configure the license information. In this section, we initialize the barcode reading options, such as barcode types and how many barcodes to read per page. Once all the settings are saved, we call the decode file method to decode the barcodes. If there are any barcodes found, we use a loop to print out the results one by one. And last but not least, we need to release the barcode result array. Please note this step is very important. If you're interested in scanning a barcode from a specific area of an image, in the online manual under C++, you can find the function definition for decode file rect. This will allow you to only scan a selected portion of the image. DynamSoft's Barcode Reader SDK also supports reading barcodes from device-independent bitmap or from a buffer. Thank you for watching this video. For more information, visit our homepage at www.dynamsoft.com.